Jesus Christ in today's gospel, a man was casting out the devil in the name of Jesus Christ. Therefore, the disciples were telling Jesus, Lord, someone is casting out the devil. We tried to stop him, but we couldn't. And Jesus was telling that if someone is casting devil in my name, he is not against me. If he is not against me, then he is for me. He says like that, you know. It's like, you know, there are many ways, there are many ways by, by which God is calling his own people to heaven. It's like uh, there is far more than one way to God. So we, 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 there are many religions we come across in today's world. Hindu religion, Islam, Judaism, Sikhism, Buddhism, everything. They have their own spiritual way of life, prayer life and then community life. Uh, in order to reach God, reach the ultimate goal, ultimate goal that is God. So we cannot say that is wrong way. What we need to do is that we need to respect dear friends, respect like uh, in theology they call it as faith seeking understanding, uh, faith seeking dialogue, uh, which in the sense we need to have dialogue with the other religion, we need to respect them, respect their values, respect their way of life because everything, everything is for the greater glory of God. Uh, in that sense we need to uh, respect our dear brother and as well. We may have Hindu friends, Sikh friends, uh, Muslim friends, anybody. They are good. They have moral values. There is nothing wrong to follow other religion. It's not necessary we have to follow only the Christian way of life to reach God, to reach heaven, to get salvation. There are plenty of ways, dear friends. We need to have dialogue with the other religion and respect them. As Jesus was telling in today's gospel, someone is casting out the devil in his name. Which means he is not against them. So he is for them. So similarly, in our lives, let us respect the other brethren who follow their own spiritual way of life to reach God. Thank you.